today we're going to do a short little reminder video about our bow hold bunny. So remember your bow hold bunny has two ears. These are his two wiggly ears, your first finger and your pinky finger. Make sure that you always do your bow hold bunny with your right hand, not your left hand. Your left hand's in charge of doing all the fingers. Your left hand gets a special job of its own, but your right hand is in charge of the bow hold bunny. Okay, here we go. Bow hold bunny starts out with having two ears and then these three fingers have a really special job, especially your thumb. Your thumb should be curved like this. Not straight like this, but curved. So once you have a pretty curved thumb, you're gonna take these two middle fingers and you're gonna put them just over the curved part so that the nail of your thumb is not visible. Okay, this is your bow hold bunny. The most important part is the curve of your thumb. See if you can make your bunny wiggle his ears like this. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle his ears. Maybe you can make your bunny, um, you know how bunnies kind of like wiggle their noses? I can't really do it, but your bunny probably could. Wiggle its nose like this. Wiggle, 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 wiggle its little face. Um, maybe your bunny could go swimming underwater. I don't really know if bunnies can swim, but that would be cool. Your bunny can swim. Your bunny could maybe go um, upstairs all the way up to the top. And then he would probably have to come back down. Or maybe he could try going on an elevator straight up and then straight down, keeping that thumb curved the whole entire time. Um, let's have our bunnies take a nap. Maybe they're going to sleep. Do you see how I have this round circle right here? You should have that. Can you see if you can peek through your bunny circle with your eye? If your hand is smushed like this, this is not really a bow hold bunny. It's more like just something that's a little bit squished. So make sure that you have a round opening and maybe you can see it better when I hold it by the wall. You can see right here, there's a round opening. See if you can look through yours and make sure that your bow hold bunny is not smushed like this, but it's open. Okay, and that curved thumb is staying the same this whole entire time. Um, think of things that you can have your bow hold bunny do, like maybe it could give you a kiss in the face, like this. Bunnies are so cute, especially baby bunnies. I get to see baby bunnies every year um, at baby animal days. It's so fun. Um, let's see, what else can our bunnies do? Maybe our bunnies could dance. Go to a rock concert with your bunny. This is a cool thing too because you can take your bow hold bunny to school uh, in the car while you're watching a show, while you're doing your homework, you can just put your hand in Boho Bunny for a few minutes and have him do a couple things like maybe he could eat dinner with you or something. Um, so keep practicing this Boho Bunny and wiggle and make, make him be with you wherever you go, always keeping this open middle part and then always keeping your thumb curved. Okay, if you have any questions, let me know. Happy practicing.